This is one of the most recognized symbols on the planet, the Red Cross. It's a symbol of hope for people in crisis around the world. Hello, my name is Natalie Glibova. When the Miss Universe pageant took place in Thailand a few months after the tsunami disaster, I was so proud to see how generously Canadians were helping people in urgent need. Yet there are so many areas of crisis that no longer make headlines, but where the need for help is great. These are the silent disasters that fade from memory when the world moves on to other stories. Hurricane Mitch struck in 1998, and the Canadian Red Cross is still working hard in Central America, rebuilding healthcare infrastructure. The Red Cross is still in Cambodia. Since 1997, they've been providing prosthetic limbs to landmine victims. And years from now, they'll still be working in South Asia, helping victims of the tsunami rebuild their lives. We're asking you to still care by becoming a monthly donor. For $15 a month, just 50 cents a day, you can help provide medical care, food, water, shelter, rehabilitation, job training, and more. Please call now. 50 cents a day may not seem like a lot, but to desperate people in need, it's crucial. It can mean a doctor with medicine arrives in the refugee camp, or a food truck reaches people who are starving. It means a missing child is reunited with his parents, or a shelter is set up for families left homeless. To vulnerable people, the power of your $15 a month is enormous. In appreciation, we'll send you this travel size first aid kit with our thanks for your ongoing trust in us. Please call now. $15 a month, just 50 cents a day. That's all it takes. On behalf of all Canadians, the Red Cross continues to reach out to people in need. Thank you for caring.